Hello Stampers, Kelly Atchison at stampabove.com coming to you live from Menasha, Wisconsin. I just thought I'd pop in here on a little impromptu. I do not have baby news. Let's be perfectly clear about that. <laughs> but I just wanted to pop in and say thank you guys so much for all your well wishes and comments. Um, I was not able to go live yesterday because I'm drowning a little bit. And I just wanted to pop in here and share some of the cards that I've received in the mail with you and let you know that I'm going to be taking a little bit of a break from Facebook Live. Hi Haley, hi Debbie. Um, I am drowning right now and I need to get my, you know what, under control. I've got kits that were supposed to go out yesterday that I miss ordered cardstock for. I didn't get enough cardstock to make all of my kits. So I have Haley and Jared are out running all over the area picking up cardstock from my wonderful team so that I can finish these kits up today. I have half of them done. The other half will be done today and going out in the mail. So if you ordered the ornate um, garden kit, it's a little bit late, but it's on its way, and I apologize profusely. I do not want to be known as the person who doesn't get things out when I say I'm going to get things out. So I thought I'd just pop in here, explain that to everybody, and let you know that I need to get things under control before I can do Facebook Live again because I haven't um, gone through my emails and I know that I've got orders that need to be processed. So I know you guys will understand because you're so fabulous and kind and compassionate and um, no baby yet. We don't have a baby. No baby. <laughs> but I just wanted to let you know that I'm going to be... Um, taking a step back until I get things under control. And as one of my team members, Vicki, said, we don't need Kelly having a nervous breakdown. And believe me, I'm not even close to anything like that, but I do need to get things back under control. So I thought I would come online, let you know what's happening, and um, share some of the beautiful cards that I have received in the mail since I was on day before yesterday. So I just got a beautiful card from Jeannie Calmus. And look at how gorgeous that is. That uses that um, laser cut paper. And these, these, these little flowers are actually washi tape. I got them out and showed them to Haley in case she wanted to use them in her um, scrapbook pages. But look at each one of these little things is a petal. And I've done these on Facebook Lives before. I made some projects with them. But you make these little flowers with the washi tape. Isn't that cool? So, so pretty. And um, Jeannie was actually sending me a card with her check because she placed an order on my Pampered Chef party. So thanks, Jeannie. And I got your beautiful card and your check. So I appreciate that. Then I have this gorgeous card. It says a million thanks on it. Holy cow. Is I just This is striking to me. It's so, so pretty. And this was from my good customer, Heather. Heather Kohler. And if you look right here, look at those beautiful flowers. She dropped those off at my house yesterday with this gorgeous card. And it says, thanks for everything you do for your customers. Your Facebook Lives bring laughter during this bad time. Thank you so much, Heather. I grabbed those flowers and I put them in the vase that I got from Connie a couple weeks ago. So I am uh, reusing and repurposing and look at how pretty they are. And the cool part too is remember this card? Look at that. It like totally matches these flowers. Now how cool is that? Yeah, so I got a lot of gorgeous stuff going on back here. Oh, I feel so much better. I didn't shower yesterday. Today I took a shower and I'm like, oh, I feel good. I'm feeling good and energized. I'm going to get the other half of those kits done and out today. Um, next, I have a card from Karen Gondon. Karen, when I opened this card, I was like, oh, I know what this does. And I have to show you guys how to do this. This is so cool. Are you ready? And it says, rainbows remind us. And then when you pull this out... 
storms will pass. Is that not the coolest thing ever? Yeah. This is, I can't remember, they call it a magic card. I'll show you guys how to make one. They're super, super cool. So, Karen says, Dear Kelly, when I started making this card about rainbows, I was reminded of, of you. You have done so much for followers to bring sunshine into their day, quarantined, daily quarantined lives. You have given so much to all of us, and I wanted to tell you thanks for sharing your life stories and cheerful disposition, and most of all, your laughter. Hey, if we can't laugh, we're going to cry. Nobody wants to see anybody crying, right? <laughs> I know you can't share this card on, on Facebook Live because I didn't use SU products. I just used what I had. No, no, no. I do not care what you use. I appreciate each and every one of your cards. Want to see it again? <laughs> Everybody likes a card they can play with, especially me. So you were wrong about that, Karen. She says, thanks for being the rainbow in my life. And P.S. I had to mess up my slide tag to fit it in the envelope. And then she says, never mind. I fixed it and used a bigger envelope. And she did. So this sticks out just a little bit more than five and a half. So she threw threw it in a great big envelope. Well, it's not great big, but you know, a much bigger envelope. Isn't that cool? Let's look at it again. Ah. Yeah. Doesn't matter what supplies you use. I will always show your cards that you're sending to me. Always. Because they are always appreciated. All right, here we go. We got some more. Oh, this was this was gorgeous. So I opened this up. There were two cards in it. I have a little note on this one. Look at how precious that is. This card obviously is not for me. It's for Haley. And it says, looking forward to meeting your new little miracle. And it says, sweet angel, bundle of joy, tiny tot, little darling, blessing, welcome baby. Congrats. I know Weedly will be loved by all. And this is from Nanette McKeel. And she put in an Amazon gift card in here. Like, how sweet is that? Haley's watching right now. And so, Haley, you have a gift card from Nanette. That was just really, really sweet. And I have a note on the front of the card, which you will not be able to have for a little while. I have, one of the reasons why I have to take a step back is not only do I have this kit that has to get out, I have to answer all the emails, send out the online classes for people that have paid me money. Um, and I have still am working on my thank you cards from March for all of my orders. And I have a swap that is due in the mail on the 24th, and that is Friday. So um, I am going to use this layout for my swap because when I opened it, I'm like, oh, I think I can use this layout for the swap that I have to make on Friday. So Nanette, double thank you because I just put my little note on here, use for swap, and I'll be setting that right over here. So I can use your layout. I love it. Oh, and Nanette, you're on here. Thank you so much. You were so sweet. Now, there's more. Wait till you see this card. Okay? It's beautiful, right? And now it does some more things. It opens up. Look how gorgeous it is. And then look at this. Is that not just super, super cute? But wait, it does more. <laughs> And I feel like I'm on Prices Right or something. But wait, there's more. It is an easel card. And the easel part is right here. Look at how pretty that is. And there's even a piece on the back that you can do your put your message on or your greeting or your whatever. But is that not just like, holy cow, right? This is gorgeous. And it says, the journey of life is best shared with a friend. We'll get through this together. Thanks. And then on the back, not only for what you do, but for being someone so special. Oh my gosh, so pretty. And um, Nanette sent me a letter. She's the one who sent me an email. And there's a funny story about a rat at her house because we have a funny squirrel story that's from here. But she also shared with me a story about her grandson and she had a newborn grandson and I believe it was eight years ago that um, everything was fine. He was born, everything was perfect. They took him home and then he wasn't eating and 
Um, they had to rush him to the hospital, and it turned out that he had a hole in his heart and needed heart surgery, and he was only like 12 days old. And so you're wrecking my makeup, Nanette, because I was like tearing up. I'm like, oh my Lord, but everything's good. Um, he just turned eight years old, and the story that I shared with you from Wendy and her daughter um, reminded Nanette of this, and it just so happens to be the anniversary of when all of that went down with this little guy. So um, your letter really touched my heart. Thank you so much. Thank you for the beautiful cards. Thank you for the awesome layout, and thank you from Haley for the gift card. Holy cow, Nanette. Just super, super sweet. Stampers are the nicest people, aren't they? Then I have this little jewel. This is from my friend Lisa. She's also on my team. And look at how stinking cute that is. I love this. I love using those letters with like a little image. And I just thought this super, super sweet. And it says, lots of Easter blessings to you and your family from Lisa and Brian. And then she gave me this little purse. Look at it. It's a half of one of our little containers. And she actually used our black foil um, cardstock for the handles. It says, friends are flowers in the garden of life. She used that beautiful bee specialty paper. And then inside of here, oh, I missed one is some Burt's Bees, and she had four of these chocolates in there, and I ate the other three. So I went out to Lisa's house to pick up the um, cardstock that I'm missing. I totally messed up my order for this kit, and it ended up that I needed 13 more reams of just one color of cardstock. I don't even know what happened. Math is hard, right? So I've been begging, borrowing, and stealing cardstock from everybody. And look who just arrived. Here she, her and Jared are out running all over the countryside picking up early espresso cardstock for my kit. And the chalk, look it. This is from Lisa that sent me home with this after I got cardstock from her. All wow. of this candy and these little treats. I was just gonna eat this chocolate. Jared just ate one. Oh my God, it has caramel in it. <laughs> so thank you, Lisa so much thank you so much and i told i told lisa not to tell Haley about the chocolate she was putting in with the car oh, stock rotten. because she would probably eat it before it got here <laughs> then i said i was just kidding <laughs> karen says she loves my backdrop of all my cards i know right isn't it pretty um nanette says the card is a double easel card i knew it did something else i just couldn't quite figure it out i know exactly what you're saying so, look at this. And then the little one does that. Yep, I'm pretty sure. Oh my gosh, it, I knew it did something else. That's I so knew there cute. was a reason for that. Look at this, you guys. I'm so glad you're on here, Nanette. Look at that paper engineering. Is that who got me the gift card? Yeah, right oh, here. Come over you. here. Look no, at this. I look like poo poo. Oh, nobody cares. <laughs> no, baby. My teeth are red because I just ate a slushie. You did just eat a slushie. I see her teeth are red. <laughs> So cute. I know, Thank and it's you. got an Amazon gift card in Aww. there. But I need the card back. Okay. Here, you can have the Amazon card. Oh, here, you take that. I don't want to be responsible for that. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> How sweet, right? Okay. So. All right, love you. Okay, are you guys leaving? Yeah. Okay. Um, did you bring your scrapbook album back? No. Okay. Do I have anything to give you? I don't know where my son lives. I haven't seen your sunglasses. Yeah. I did not. Okay. okay. Bye, Jared. Bye. Thank you guys so much. Haley messages me this morning. She says, Mom, can you make pancakes for breakfast? And I was still in bed. She didn't message me. She called me. And um, so I, um, I answered the phone. I was dead asleep. I answered the phone. She's like, can you make breakfast? And I'm like, no. <laughs> I have too much to do today. I'm like drowning. So I sprung out of bed, took a shower. And that's when she's like, we're so bored. Do you have anything for us to do? And I'm like, yes, you can go run everywhere and pick up cardstock for me. So they went north side of Appleton, which was probably 10 or 15 miles out north of Appleton, all the way to Sherwood, which is another 12 miles the other way, all over the place. And she said they were having a lot of fun. So 
<laughs> Jody says, why is Haley there? She's supposed to be having a baby. I know, right? Yesterday was the due date. We thought this would be over. I was actually early with Haley. I can't remember if I was due on July 10th and I had her on the 1st or if I was due on the 5th and I had her on the 1st, but I was early, so we thought she'd go early. You know, I don't know how that all works, T. I don't know. But anyways, um, thank you guys so much for all your love and support, and I will be right on top of it to let you know when that baby is born. Um, if you came in late, I just wanted to mention that I am going to be taking a step back from my Facebook Lives because I have gotten behind on the rest of my obligations. And so I need to get those under control. If you ordered my Ornate Garden Kit, it will be going out in the mail today. I have half of them done. The other half I had to wait for all this cardstock because I messed up my order. I don't know, how, I don't even know what happened, but it was, it was like, I was missing so much cardstock that I needed. So I only have one box that I have to cut for. There were 12 cards and a box in that online class. So everything else is cut and waiting for me to assemble. Now I have the box card stock here and I can get that done and out the door. Then I have to do thank you cards for my March orders. I sent out some, but not all. I have to get the rest of those out. And I have a swap due out of here in the mail on Friday. And I think I have to, I only have to make about 20 cards for that. So that's not bad. When I get things under control, I will be back Facebook Live, and I'm hoping it's only going to be a day or two. <laughs> Diana says, you're in overload mode. I am in overload mode, and I need to get it under control because if you spread yourself too thin, you're not, I'm, I'm disappointing myself by not meeting my obligations, and I'm disappointing my customers, and that's not how I operate. So I'm going to straighten my crown, get it back together, and I will be back as soon as I can. If Haley has that baby before I come back, I will definitely let you know. And you know you're going to be so sick of pictures. So sick of them. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for um, following me. I really appreciate it. Thank you for tuning in. And um, I will be back shortly. Have a great Tuesday. Bye-bye.